expected to be very messy. Guys, not messy here. Not at all. In fact, our big <laughs> weather story for today is near record highs up towards 70 degrees. You know, and that's usually what you see this time of year. Whenever you see somebody that's getting a big storm or a lot of cold, some other places are going to see the mild weather. Fortunately, we're seeing the mild weather for not only today, but the next couple of days. You're very thankful for that. Sure. <laughs> I guess you could say we're on the good side of the weather yes. map. I want to show you what it looks like if you're getting your family ready for school. Taft, one of these days, probably want to dress in layers? Definitely in layers. Yeah, you want to bundle up this morning. Temperatures a little chilly. Good news, not much of a wind out there as those temperatures are hovering. Upper 20s to around 30 degrees, but a big time warm up this afternoon with temperatures 20 degrees above average. So just a great Monday as we get the work week started. We'll be nearing 70 degrees by 3 p.m. And actually the next three days, we're going to enjoy the warm weather. So a frosty start to the day, upper 20s at 7, up to near 60 at noon and 68 at 4. Across Oklahoma, we're going to wake up to clear skies. and We have a lot of sunshine, a lot of blue sky headed our direction for the next few days. If you have any travel plans just out of Oklahoma into the neighboring states, the weather will also be quieted in Texas, Arkansas, Missouri, and Kansas. The big weather system, as you probably heard about, is this storm system working its way up the east coast, a nor'easter. It's going to bring some areas of very heavy snow, especially toward the coast. So places like New York City up through Boston and the New England states are going to have major travel issues. More than a foot of snow and very low visibilities in that area. Right now, much of Pennsylvania is already getting some snow from winter weather advisories and winter storm warnings, which are in effect. We're beginning our day cold with temps in the 20s and 30s, so you want to take the coat with you this morning. Probably won't need it this afternoon, but you do need it for your morning drive. 27 prior, it's also 27 into Benita, Stigler at 28, 30 Muskogee, Bartlesville running colder at 23. So your morning drive along Interstate 44, the weather should be uneventful for you. As Taft mentioned, the wind is light. All morning, the wind is going to stay fairly light. Temp at 31 right now in Tulsa. On the future track, as we don't have any big storm systems headed our direction, we'll have a lot of sunshine for today, also into tomorrow. Tomorrow morning at this time, we'll have clear skies and cool temps. Then another nice warm up during the day with highs nearing 70 for Tuesday. For today, we'll make a run toward 70 degrees. Highs in the upper 60s here in Tulsa. Light wind this morning becoming breezy during the afternoon. And then tonight we'll have clear skies. Not as cold as this morning. We'll be just above freezing here in T-Town with a low of 38. Your 70 forecast shows we have three days and getting warmer each day. Low 70s on Tuesday. Then on Wednesday, our exact high is going to depend on the timing of a cold front, which will move in Wednesday evening, but we'll see a high of in the mid 70s, a little cooler or warmer if it arrives sooner or later. Three days of warmer weather, then cooler on Thursday. The weekend, we'll see a chance for light rain on Saturday and 40s. And another check of that Monday morning traffic still in great shape.